Hello there, my name is Cheryl Liu Chen, CEO of LiveWorks and the creator of the 24-Hour Woman. I've been blessed to have worked with organizations from around the world as a talent innovation strategist, helping them to engage, motivate and to attract talent across different spectrums. I'm going to be sharing with you today a very interesting conversation that I've just had with some of the smart organizations that are implementing this strategy going forward and it's called all roles are flexible yes we know that there's a demand of work-life flexibility but we just didn't know that it's going to get to this tipping point smart organizations are innovating and looking at the possibilities of how they can implement this policy called all roles are flexible I'm excited about it because the potential for you to be engaging your talent pool and attract new talent is tremendous. And yet, there are some managers I know and organizations that are a bit apprehensive, you know, what does it all mean? This particular episode, I want to help you understand what does it all mean if you were to embark on all roles are flexible kind of perspective or policy. Number one, the benefit is obvious. You are able to attract a wider pool of talent. You are able to attract talent who have left you for maybe caregiving reasons, study reasons, whatever reasons that you can bring them back because there's a new way that you are looking at how work gets done. When, where and how. When we look at the policy, all roles are flexible is really looking at so which part of the role is flexible based on location or based on time on the other hand you can look at it and say which part of the role is fixed based on location and time and if you are not certain well then take a couple of the roles that are reporting to you and study it with your team member study it and then brainstorm what are the possibilities of flexibility because this will allow your current talent to be better engaged with you because they are provided for and supported to look at their work-life challenges and you are also able to then attract new talent because your employee value proposition now gives you an additional edge. So first thing, look at some of the roles that you already have and work through to see which are the ones that you can offer some kind of flexibility. Be rest assured that not all roles have the same kind of flexibility because it is really still dependent on location and time flexibility. If you're not sure, then come on over to LiveWorks.Asia. Look for this particular episode. I have a PDF right there to help you as a manager or stakeholder identify which are the roles and what's possible. The second thing for you to explore is to have a conversation with your team. If you are looking at all roles are flexible, what might be some of the challenges the team might face? First of all, I can think of is in terms of communication. Your team may be thinking, how do I communicate with my team members if I'm on flexibility? The team might also be thinking about, so how do I make sure that I'm reporting in and people know that I'm contributing? The other question would be, you know, how would you measure the performance of the other person versus me who is on flexibility? These are questions that you might want to have you know, a conversation with your team so that there's a good understanding and there's a level of trust and rapport established going into all roles are flexible perspective. The third is to look at how can you run a pilot. I know that you know all roles are flexible are probably going to be quite challenging for some of the managers because it's, it's like, so how do I manage all this? Well, you don't have to jump right in. I would say pilot some of the roles, experiment with it, tweak it, and make it work for you and your team. Remember, the benefits of it will far outweigh the issues that you will face. And if you come to think about it, if you don't do any of this, if you don't explore flexibility, what might be the possible cost? One, you might lose your current talent pool because they want some flexibility you may lose the opportunity to be engaging with a new talent pool because you are not offering that kind of work pattern that they are looking for or thirdly you are not able to be able to look at hiring or retaining the talent pool that you want to grow in your leadership team for example women young men and women who value their work life the cost is certainly a lot more than the benefits Therefore, explore this where smart organizations are heading. All roles are flexible. 
My name is Cheryl, the creator of the 24-Hour Woman and CEO of LiveWorks. If you like this particular episode and want to learn more progressive way of managing your team and your organization and be a contemporary leader, subscribe. I look forward to seeing you in the next episode where I have more exciting training and insights to be sharing with you. See you at the next episode. Until then, live a life that's most excellent.